Welcome to Crypto Coins, where we review the best coins for you. How's it going, my friends? Welcome back to Crypto Coins. My name is Freddie Colton, and today I'm going to be discussing a project that I think is really important right now. It actually speaks as to the idea of why people like myself, yourself, really anyone is into the cryptocurrency world. And today we are going to be discussing Viblos. Now, uh, or Viblos, um, <clears throat> but you kind of understand V I B L O S, just to give you an idea. And Viblos.org, Viblos.org is uh, their website. Now, it is the first centralized social network based on the principles of Swiss democracy. Now, Swiss democracy is by technical definitions and not even like a, uh, not even by um, opinion, by technical definition is more actually democratic than a lot of countries that call themselves democratic, like the United States, stuff like that, that uh, we know are not exactly true democracies anymore. Now, uh, that being said, of course, <laughs> to be clear, not a political statement at all, but just me kind of trying to explain to you best I can as to what they want to do. They want to make this a platform for the people by the people and just truly bring together people and allow free voices to be heard. I think that's very important these days. I think people are trying to be shut down. We know at the moment there is the divide between the media and the people that is very apparent at the moment. So I really appreciated this project. Wanted to go ahead and discuss this one and let you know a little bit about it. Now we're going to check out their social media and jump over to their introduction video. <clears throat> Now, this project, uh, the Viblo, is on CoinGecko, so you can check it out here, and CoinMarketCap, which gives it a lot of legitimacy. That makes me very excited to see about this. We can see that it's been having a wonderful day. Very excited that I went ahead and invested early, a little earlier than even making this. Gone up 30% today, and let's hope for more. Let's cross our fingers and and of course come check this one out the moment you see this video if you you know uh when this episode comes out it might be even higher probably will be uh because this one's been doing really well and again their message is really cool now keep in mind this is not financial advice just me describing a project that i have some real passion in i invested in and as you can see has already made me some uh some money so good on them we, now we have our bsc scan right here for the project just so you can see people buying selling quantities of of everything their twitter and this project isn't as huge yet um and i say yet because they're going to just explode once they get into the main sphere but 677 followers over here on twitter uh, about 3,000, I'm sure soon enough, because it's been growing quickly over here on Telegram. So basically 3,000 here in a moment. We've got our white paper, which we actually will get to the white paper momentarily. We'll get back to that. And uh, I apologize, my uh, thing's been a little funny. There we go. It's, uh, it's, I apologize, my computer is acting a little funny with the way that it's pulling these up. But um, you can find all of these, by the way, everything I've clicked on is on the website. Of course, double, triple check your official links. Make sure they're all from the actual website of the actual project. Now, we can see here, this is their security audit, just in case you were curious about that. I know personally myself, I am always a little bit worried about that. And <clears throat> in conclusion, it has been fully audited and approved. Just kind of, sh you can check out through everything like here. It passed, by the way, everything. So it's really run it at a beautiful percentage of pass rate. Some of them actually, like, there are projects, and I say some of them, obviously not this one, but there are projects that, um, that it, it actually, uh, it, they don't pass all of them. So that's really cool to see that. This is actually the team who are all dogs. Come hang out, come shoot the video with me, CJ. It's Catmanta Jones, everyone. And little CJ wanted, was so excited to come help me introduce the team of this project, weren't you? Um, anyway, so uh, we can see the team right here. Now, all of their LinkedIn's, and what I really love is literally all of their LinkedIn. Even the gentleman on Reet, who I apologize, I'm covering him up. We'll put me right here for a moment. I'll hang right here so I can show everyone off. Um, but uh, we can see the team right here. You can get full visual if you do come to their website. This is uh, viblos.org, um, and this is the team section. There's also 
more to go here, which we will go over. Whoa! And I will go ahead and put myself back here. Uh, now you can, of course, contact the team as well if you would like to. They seem very easy to get in touch with. I really love how open they are about, you know, what their deal is, who they are, their audits, that sort of thing. This is the project roadmap right above everyone. So the information being shared in order to outline some of the current product plans, it's shared just for informational purposes, and it's not a binding commitment, and I think we all know that about a, uh, any real roadmap, it's, it's always just what we want to get done. Uh, so let's see, quarter two, or excuse me, quarter one of 2022, a lot of twos, close beta, public beta, POC, quarter two, go live MVP, open registration, token integration, go live 1.0, and release 1.5, in that order of quarters... Wow, that rhymed really well. I did not mean for that. And we're going to jump on their video as well. I just wanted to show this off, and I want to say they did a very good job. A uh, huge commendation to whoever produced this for them. I assume they produced it, but I would, I would have to assume either someone on the team really did a great job directing producing, or they hired an, you know, an out-of-house team to help them and either way so well done so let's go ahead and take this take this ride do you think there is freedom of expression in social networks freedom of expression and democracy are part of viblos's dna a concept that is currently losing its value and that viblos wants to recover viblos that's just to be clear viblos there are certainly some limits that should not be crossed, but unfortunately, many platforms have become instruments of censorship because they have very definite political or- That's hugely impressive, by the way. I think that most people will look over- I know this sounds so funny. I used to, uh, I used to be a ballerina myself, actually, and mostly because I was tall and able to lift women. Uh, that's sure true as to why I ever got cast in ballets in high school, but I used to be- so interested in you know performing that of course i was i i did and uh that lifting someone like that is very hard so big a big ups to them for having like such a fascinating or ideological leader. leanings viblos will never demonetize or censor anyone for having a different opinion what that is I mean, whoa, right? I'm being half sarcastic, right? And half not sarcastic. The sarcasm comes into like, everyone says that they're gonna be like this, every platform does. But the beautiful part of it is like, this should have happened by now. How has this not happened? And they took it and they just made their own thing with it. Because again, they're using the blockchain. So they're not subject to any one person, like one bank or one overarching person. So that's, I mean, kudos to them. That's so crazy. I mean, again, so crazy as in it's like, it's not even a new concept at all. Like we've been begging for this to be real, but it's crazy someone's following through. Our vision is to democratize social networks. To also, I got to just say that girl in the background who's just doing her thing, dancing, dude, she she has great timing. I love that. I wish I was that good. Like, a timing as a dancer. I I was never actually like a good ballerina dancer or a good dancer in general. I just again, I'm tall. I can lift people. To drive business and wealth creation for consumers and content creators, join this movement for freedom of expression and help us create a true alternative that does not That's obey. That's me dancing right there, dude. That's those ladies right there. That's that's on my level. Anyone's political or oh, ideological interests. Biblos is freedom. I truly, truly appreciate this. Now let's read uh, why Viblos. Let's read their little uh, their little blurb. And I don't usually try to read people's blurbs, but I'll tell you what. I really like this project. I think it's well done. Uh, great team to it. So let's just go ahead. Are you tired of giant tech companies using your data as well as targeting and bombarding you with advertisements without your consent? And worst of all, you get nothing out of it. Viblos is going to create a new. Uh, excuse me, a new synergy on the internet. This new model combines blockchain technology with social networks by allowing you to generate income as a passive user without having to create content. Viblos is going to make the impossible possible. On Viblos, you'll be able to earn money in multiple different ways while at the same time sharing and monetizing your contributions in a secure, transparent, and verifiable way. 
Users or content creators can decide to be paid not only with fiat money or other cryptocurrencies, but with platforms own token as well, which I think that's very, in uh, that's very intelligent. Uh, excuse me, I'm, I'm hiccuping as, as talking. I think that's very intelligent. Uh, and I also want to say that I think that that is the future with most social media, in my opinion, is a lot of it's going to go towards the crypto, uh, you know, like, like how people make money. I, I'm sure YouTube's going to start dealing in crypto soon enough. I can foresee, and I'm just putting this out here, I have no idea, but I can foresee a YouTube coin. Um, and so this is actually, and you can see right here, this is their infographic for um, kind of what they can do. So support creators, uh, offer your services, sell or trade, create your NFT, finance your business, privacy and security, uh, community support, advertise your company. Um, it's, it's ecological and sustainable. Uh, the Viblos in the blockchain, um, empower yourself and succeed, which I love the positivity of this project. It's inspired uh, and watch ads and get paid, which fair enough. We watch ads all day anyway. Why not get paid about it, right? We can see some really cool uh, places that it looks like they have uh, got some different articles about them over here. Excuse me. Uh, problems and solutions built for the people by the people, which, by the way, is exactly what I said at the very beginning. And I completely have not read that yet. So I just want to kind of like that's just the vibe I get from this project, to be honest. I read through I do read through things at first, but I kind of skim over them so we can learn some things together as we go. Make it a little more entertaining for both of us, uh, because if I just read over it like it's like a script, that's boring because it's no fun. So, again, just fun to have things like that where i totally understand the project and clearly they do as well the, you know some people i know it's funny but i feel like outsiders understand their project more than they do because they don't understand how they're putting themselves off and someone like myself who studies this kind of thing every day does i really catch that sort of thing so i love to see that um Join the new economic system, blockchain, the liberating force, which we, I'm sure anyone watching this agrees. New business models for its users, freedom, and zero demonetization. Which again, crazy and crazy. It's, it's, it's a platform I'm looking at personally. Uh, not that I'm worried about demonetization, but I just want to support good platforms like that, willing to do that kind of thing. Um, yeah, and so we can sort of see, and then and that is that is all they wrote there, folks. We did see their audit. You can buy the uh, the Viblo token as well, very easily. If you just click through there, you can go through, hook your wallet up, get that all set, of course. Um, decentralized governance. Vi Viblos is a an industry leading um, decentralized autonomous organization created to give back control to the user. Yeah, just telling you what we know. So they've got a DAO that is social media equivalent to direct democracy in Switzerland. The governance lies in the hands of all the users who control their own data and protect their own privacy. A bunch of really great videos about it, discussing if you want to be a content creator, stakeholder, marketer, and general user, what that is going to be like for you. And and I think we all have a general idea of what that's going to be. But if you're really interested, I, I recommend coming and checking this out, reading through a little more. Um, token allocation, very important to discuss that. Now, 5% uh, marketing promotion, that's right at that number that I always want to see. I want to see 5 to 6% in marketing and promotion. That's because, again, marketing is very important to put it towards this kind of a project. Uh, let's see here. We've got 6% um, liquidity and staking, advisors 5, early contributor 10, founder 20, um, transparency. So, And then you can check out the Viblos wallets as well. Uh, this is the roadmap, so kind of getting down towards the roadmap, which we just saw the team sort of rounding that part of everything out. And we're just going to skim the white paper here at the end, as I mentioned we would. I know this one's running a little longer than I meant to, uh, but we'll just sort of skim the white paper here. Tells you a little bit about privacy concerns, what your concerns might be, how they might be able to answer those. So if you do have any questions as to how this might be able to help you, the ecosystem might be able to answer these questions for you, how the network work is in infrastructured uh, or structured I guess I wouldn't say infrastructure there the marketing the tokenomics which you did see already a little more detailed roadmap of the team of course and that my friends is Viblos video blog society so love this project really interested clearly went way too long on this video but I really have a lot of passion for this one I'm so excited about it thank you as always for coming by crypto coins my name is Freddie Colton I'll see you in the next episode